Hurricane Multimedia. We're here at Winter NAM 2011 in Anaheim, California. Today we're taking a look at some of the new IK offerings. We're showing off the iRig mic here. Pull that out. It's the iRig mic, and it's the first handheld condenser microphone for these iOS devices that plugs simply into your interface here. Real simple connection. The Vocalive app, which kind of syncs in along with it, is simply it's a vocal enhancement suite that gives you a chance for us vocalists to have pitch correction, de-essing, harmony, choir, reverb, delays, EQs, phasers, the whole nice selection of different vocal suite effects. As you bring in, you see the actual unit here. You click on a knob value, drag it up and down as you'd expect. Here, bypass. Very simple to get into, very easy to use. Some morphing effects. Gonna get a crazy chipmunk thing to a uh, satanic, like very white kind of effect. Yeah. Pretty neat stuff. Give your pitch correction, so you select your key. Now, intensely, uh, we're gonna aim to correct. Select your scale, start singing. Very quick and easy. Jeez. Now, what's really, really cool is that you also have a recorder in here. By default, it comes with a single track. You can also expand up to a four track as an in-app purchase. Of course, you want to import your songs and sing and practice along, so you can easily bring in your song. This will be added in via Wi-Fi, file sharing, or iPod, you know, straight from your device here. And once in, you simply can practice it out, you know, oh. lay down your vocals, whatever it may be, and export that out for further use, either into your DAW. But what's really cool is that you can take this and use the mic for podcasts, for video interviews. You can plug it into iPhone 4 and do, you know, interviews straight up with that. Is that a dynamic mic in there, or is that a little, like, a little condenser? It's actually, a, it's an electric condenser mic. Okay. Yeah. And it's, it's a real simple connection, straightforward. You know, we pretty much have all, all the cables here. We're running out to the headphones, but again, you can run out to a video camera, to a mixer, to a PA. Okay, so this is actually part of the cable to the mic. Yes, exactly. Okay, little... And this is connects to the uh, actual headphones right and if there. If I listen to the headphones, do you hear a real-time monitor? So it actually... Exactly, yeah. Oh, really? To be hearing everything taking place, to so hear the pitch correction as you're singing, you hear the effects, everything. Very, very low latency, I'm assuming? I mean, is it... Absolutely. Um, what you know, the latency are you going to get out of that? It's very responsive. It's all meant to be real time. Yeah. Um, I don't have the exact millisecond latency, but it's ultra low. Almost undetectable. No, it's very quick. Wow. Um, you can have low and ultra low settings here for latency purposes. In case it becomes an issue, you have input, output level adjustments. You can even use the built in mic within the device as well. Some other uh, functionalities in different settings. Does the recording app have any edit editing capabilities? Or just strictly just a recorder. Very straightforward recorder. Yeah. Um, yeah, no editing capabilities, yeah. but you can add in your effects. There are panning, volume controls, so it's very easy to get into, awesome. very easy to use. You can bounce that mix out to your friends or you know, again for further use in your doll. Thanks very much. Thanks for your time. We appreciate it.